Prophet Ibn Joshua has given us the anointing water to pray for people, for those that are sick, for those that are oppressed, for those that need freedom, for those that need breakthrough in the United States. So we're gonna, we will pray with you, for you, with this anointing water. This water is just water. There's nothing special about it, but yet it's special because it's been set apart for God. Just like anointing oil can be used as a medium to pray for the sick like the Bible says just like the staff of Moses was used to split the Red Sea and to do miracles just like many other mediums that God has used throughout the times Old Testament and the New Testament when uh, Peter used handkerchiefs or people used handkerchiefs and belts of uh, Apostle Paul to lay uh, on the sick and they recovered demon possessed or uh, received their freedom his shadow was healing people and sick those that were laying on the side so any mediums God can use and this is just one of the mediums that God has that God is using at this time and age amen so as you're standing here and waiting to receive prayer we focus our eyes on the cross and what Jesus has already done there's nothing we can do no efforts no amount of efforts that you can put to receive something more or less what that whatever Jesus has earned is already earned and it's ready for you amen so let's look on the cross what Jesus has prepared for us and the prayer will be done in Jesus name and you will receive your miracle your breakthrough whatever you need from Jesus amen so let's open in prayer say Lord Jesus say Lord Jesus open my heart to your word say Lord Jesus open my heart to your faith say Lord Jesus open my heart to your spirit amen amen get ready to receive amen right now we can see that many people from all over the united states have come here today to receive prayer with the anointing water and as they're here today they've come with faith so if you're watching online right now or if you're here today in the congregation know that distance is not a barrier to the move of the holy spirit so wherever you are you can receive as well as these people are being prayed for with the medium of the anointing water know that it is by faith that we are connected to jesus christ but we know that jesus christ truly is the answer to all fundamental issues of life so whatever your problem is today whatever your need whatever your circumstances whatever your situation we know that Jesus Christ is the solution. We know that Jesus brings a lasting solution to all of the problems that we may face. So today we can stand boldly and confidently knowing that our healing, our deliverance, our breakthrough is secure in the blood of Jesus Christ. So as these people continue to receive that prayer with the anointing water, it's not the water that saves, heals, and delivers. It's Jesus Christ. It's His blood. And we know that that name, Jesus, is working in the Spirit through the medium of the anointing water. As the evangelists continue to pray in His name, we know that there is no power in heaven and on earth that compares to that name Jesus because all power in heaven and earth have been invested into that wonderful name and that there is no name above that name and his name brings healing his name brings deliverance his name brings salvation and breakthrough into our lives in Jesus name As we continue with this prayer line today with the anointing water we can boldly say together thank you Jesus because what we have been waiting for has already been done it's already come that healing that deliverance that blessing has already been done and Jesus Christ is ready to heal he's ready to deliver he's ready to bless you this means that the job is already half done and what is your role your role is to have faith. Your role is to believe that it can be done. Because the instant you believe, you have. The instant that you believe, it is yours in Jesus' name. So whether you're in the congregation today or you're watching online, you can reach out your hand. If you're online, you can touch your screen and believe that your case will not escape the anointing of God. all over the world 
as you watch God's power. Trust Him. Your situation will change. You will be positioned to accomplish your divine destiny. As you are trusting God's power, never confuse these two. Satan come to steal, kill, and destroy, while Jesus Christ has come to give an abundant life. Whatever you are going through as an unpleasant situation, it is from the pit of hell. Satan is the architect. Jesus Christ is the solution. Embrace him and receive your solution. Catch the fire of the Holy Ghost. the evangelists continue to pray we want to remind everybody that is here today that it is only by faith that we can receive from God we know that the scripture says in Hebrews chapter 11 that it is faith that pleases God those who come to him must believe that he is and that he's the rewarder of those who diligently seek him so wherever wherever you are today connect yourself in faith In the name of Jesus Christ. Just pick her up. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Pick up. Pick up. Who are you? Answer right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Who are you? Fire all over your body right now. Answer right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Who are you? What have you done in her life? What have you done in her life? Fire all over your body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. What have you done in her life? What have you done in her families? Speak right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. What have you done in her life? What have you done to her body? Fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Speak right now. Who are you? <laughs> Who are you? Fire all over, all over her body right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Fire all over her body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire all over your body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We command you to speak right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. What have you done to her life? In the mighty name of Jesus, speak clearly. What have you done to her health? What have you done to her family? Answer right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Speak clearly. What have you done to your health? Fire all over your body. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command you to speak. Who are you? You are in the arena of liberty and you cannot stand in this place. Jesus is stronger than you. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command you to speak. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Loose your body. Loose your body. Loose your body. Fire all over. Fire all over in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose her. Fire all over her body. Loose her. Loose her right now. Loose her. Loose her. Fire. Come on church. Let's stretch our hands. Let's begin to pray. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Leave her. Loose her. Loose her. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose her right now. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose her right now. Fire all over your body in the mighty name of Jesus. Fire all over your body right now. You are in the arena of liberty and Jesus is greater than you. We command you out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose your body, loose your mind, loose your soul. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. All over your body, fire all the spirit. Fire all the spirit. Fire all over your body. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. All over your body. Fire the Holy Spirit in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every single one of you out right now. Leave her body. Leave her body. Every single one of you out of her body, out of her mind, out of her soul. Out. Fire all over your body. Fire all over your body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. All over your body. Holy Ghost fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 
because of Christ be free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ in the mighty name of Jesus Christ we declare you free in the mighty name of Jesus ma'am can you get up can you get up how are you feeling now you feeling good yeah well, Jesus Christ has put an end to your past and give you a brand new future. Say, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm free. I'm free, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. I'm free. I'm suffering. I'm suffering. Praise the Lord. This woman has been declared free in Jesus' mighty name. We give God all the glory because we know that where the light of God is, no darkness can prevail. So as you just watched a spiritual combat between light and darkness, you could see that the light truly wins out every single time. We know that Satan is the architect of all of our issues, all of our problems today. But whatever our problem is, we know that our God is greater than all of those problems. Remember that Prophet TV Joshua says that unclean spirits are the cause of enormous growth of sorrow, hardship, bitterness, bondage, and world heartache. They cause men to lose control and commit all shameful acts. However, one thing is clear. Demons know that they must submit to the authority in the name of Jesus Christ. So viewers all over the world, as you watch. Let's do a declaration of faith. Say, I'm saved. I'm saved. Jesus, is my savior. Jesus is my savior. Say, I'm healed. I'm healed. Jesus, is my healer. Jesus is my healer. Say, I am delivered. I am delivered. Jesus is my deliverer. Say, my past is over. I'm a brand new person in the name of Jesus. Now begin to walk in the light of your testimony. You, can make, you may take your seats. This way, this way. We welcome everybody once again to this prayer line with the anointing water in the United States of America. This is the anointing water the Prophet T.B. Joshua has given to Hungry Generation team to pray with for people who will come in need for all of their needs and we understand today it's not the anointing water that heals saves or delivers but it's Jesus for the anointing is done in his name and as the word was spoken today is that because of the grace of Jesus today the foundations of your problems will be removed in Jesus name Jesus Christ has suffered all of our pain and so it makes it unnecessary for us to suffer the exactly same thing that Jesus paid for on the cross whether it's a sickness, whether it's demonic things that hold back things in our life today, because of Christ, we have the opportunity to walk freely and to walk in blessing of God in Jesus' name. Amen. And so I want you to right now as you're standing there to say this simple prayer out right after me. Say, Lord Jesus, open my heart to your word. Lord Jesus, open my heart to your spirit. Lord Jesus, open my heart to your faith in Jesus name. Be ready to receive today in the name of Jesus. These people have come here with many afflictions, many sicknesses, many problems, many circumstances and we know that when you have exhausted your mental and emotional resources you can no longer rely on yourself. You simply have to trust something, someone stronger, wiser and smarter than yourself. So these people have come here today because Jesus was their choice. Jesus was the one that they have chosen to hold on to because he was the one who raised the dead. He delivered Paul and Silas and he will deliver them. He rescued Daniel from the mouth of the lion and he will rescue you today simply by connecting in faith. Know that your future is restored in Jesus' name. As you can see right now, this woman is not at ease with herself as she is receiving that prayer as the Holy Spirit is continuing to touch her, continuing to do a work in her life and know that as the Holy Spirit is touching the lives of the people here that you can be a partaker of this divine healing, deliverance and breakthrough that is happening right here live and direct at the Anointing Water Prayer Line in the United States that truly nothing can stop us from reaching God. We know that Satan came to steal, kill and destroy. He came to rob us of a free life. But Jesus Christ came 
to give us an abundant life, to give us a life that is fulfilled, a life that is free, a life that is worth living. So truly worthy is the Lamb who was slain. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain. And we are blessed today because of the blood of Jesus Christ. Because Jesus did not withhold his own life from us. God did not withhold his precious gift from us, but he gave his own son up willingly and freely so that we could be saved, so that we could be eternally a part of the kingdom of God. We know that the blood of Jesus is what sets us free from every sickness, every bondage, every disease, whatever foolish thing that you may be facing today. The answer today is the blood of Jesus Christ. The answer is hidden in that name Jesus because we know that it is the name above all names that every single knee must bow to the name Jesus because all the power in heaven and on earth has been invested into that name and right now you can see the name Jesus working in the spirit through the medium of the anointing water as the evangelists continue to pray in faith we know that it is by faith that we receive from the Holy Spirit it is by faith that we are connected to this power that you see today as the anointing water is being administered you can see the real authentic and forceful power of God affecting the lives of these people not just on the physical level but on the level of the spirit as the anointing water is acting as the contact point between the spirit of God and the spirit of man to remove every single unclean spirit to remove every single darkness right now you can see that this woman is not at ease with herself as a spiritual warfare is happening right now it is a battle between light and darkness and we know that where the light of God is no darkness can prevail In the mighty name of Jesus, who are you? Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus. All over your body. Fire of all the Spirit. Speak out. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? What have you done in her life? Fire all over your body. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, fire all over your body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. What troubles you caused her? Speak clearly. What troubles you caused her? What have you done to her life? What have you done to her family? Fire all over your body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You cannot stand in the arena of light. Jesus has overcome you and right now I command you in the mighty name of Jesus. Answer and speak clearly. Who are you? Who are you? What have you done in her life? What troubles did you bring? Right now I command you in the mighty name of Jesus. Your time has expired. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. All over her body. Father Holy Spirit. Church let's stretch our hands. Let's begin to pray. All over her body. Father Holy Spirit fire because of Christ be free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ because of Christ be delivered in the mighty name of Jesus because of Christ be free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ 
Holy Ghost, fire all over her body. Holy Ghost, fire all over her body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, be free. Because of Christ, be delivered in the mighty name of Jesus. Because of Christ, leave her right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every darkness, every planting are planted by God. We command them out in the mighty name of Jesus. Out, out, out right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. From her body, in the mighty name of Jesus. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Church, let's stretch our hands. Let's begin to declare. Let's begin to command this demon to leave this body. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, we command out. Because of Christ, out in the mighty name of Jesus. Because of Christ, be free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, be delivered in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, be free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We declare you free in the mighty name of of Jesus Christ. Come on church, let's put our hands together. <laughs> Say thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. water prayer line in the USA and the evangelists administering the anointing water always remember that Jesus Christ has overcome that he is the victor that he is the one that holds the name so just rely on Jesus Christ as you are watching that there is no barrier between you and your answer right now so as those that are watching and those that are here present in this place remember that distance is not a barrier receive what you need today if it is a breakthrough if it is your promise if it is a renewal of your salvation remember that as they are receiving you can receive too in Jesus name Evangelists are administering the anointing water. They are saying the name of Jesus. All power in heaven and on earth has been invested in the name of Jesus Christ. At the mention of the name Jesus, Satan has to listen. As the evangelists pray for the people, the Holy Ghost fire is exposing whatever that is not of Jesus in their lives. And that people are being set free from the hands of darkness in Jesus' name. The moment Jesus enters our lives, we are taken out of the satanic kingdom of darkness and placed into the kingdom of Jesus, the kingdom of light. To God be the glory. So touch your screen, catch the fire as you are in this place. If you are present or those that are watching on live stream, remember that you can receive your healing, your breakthrough, and your deliverance today. In Jesus' name. As you're here today remember that believing is possessing when you believe in his word you possess the thing that the word has guaranteed the instant you believe you have the instant you believe it's yours the instant that you believe you become a possessor of the father's nature no matter the signs no matter the situation before or after no matter what symptoms you experience you can say my heart knows that the case is settled so you can touch your screen if you're watching online or you can reach out today in faith and receive your own answer so you can take your position in the believer's authority and be assured that he hears you and if he hears you it is as good as an answer because you and him are cooperating Say this out loud after me. Say, I am saved. Jesus is my Savior. 
Say, I am healed. Jesus is my healer. Say, I am delivered. Jesus is my deliverer. Say, my past is over. I am justified. I'm no longer condemned. I will walk in the light of my testimony. In Jesus' name. Come on, if you're happy, put your hands together for Jesus Christ. You may... All the power on earth, in heaven and under earth has been invested in the name of Jesus. And if we put our trust in the name of Jesus, the name of Jesus will shake the very foundations of our troubles, of our problems and of our sickness. So let's look up unto Jesus. Let's look up unto the cross and what He has done for us. And let's trust in that all-powerful, almighty name of Jesus to bring solution to your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's open up this in prayer say, Lord Jesus, open my heart to your word. Say, Lord Jesus, open my heart to your faith. Say, Lord Jesus, open my heart to your spirit. Now receive in faith. We thank God for this wonderful opportunity to be here today under this divine atmosphere where the Spirit of God is present, where the Spirit of God is moving. And we can see the mighty hand of God working in the lives of these people, beginning to shake the foundation of their problems, creating a lasting solution, something that they can rely on. We know that Jesus Christ has given a permanent blow to all of our problems. Never a sickness Jesus cannot heal. Never a problem Jesus cannot solve. Never an unpleasant situation he cannot subdue. Never a burden he cannot bear. Never a disease he cannot cure. By his stripes we are forgiven, healed, blessed, saved, and given a permanent solution. Never a friend like Jesus. Never a healer like Jesus Christ. Are you lost? Follow Jesus Christ, for he is the roadmap to the lost. Are you hungry? Follow Jesus Christ, for he is the bread to the hungry. Are you thirsty? Follow Jesus Christ, for he is the water to the thirsty. So this morning, you can connect yourself to the living waters to subdue the thirst and hunger that you are looking for know that in him we have a lasting solution to the problems that we are facing and in him we are given a new future we are given a new start we are given freedom that comes only from Christ Jesus so whatever situation you may be facing whatever problem has been hindering your breakthrough whatever barrier has been stopping you from reaching the next level in life know that Jesus Christ is able to crush every barrier to remove every limitation to break down every wall that is stopping you from succeeding to the next level in life so today you can boldly and confidently declare that I am going to a new level in life that whatever situation you have is no more in Jesus mighty name you can declare a new level in life today in Jesus mighty name to God's power he can do the impossible so what is your situation today is it sickness is your situation needing a breakthrough whatever it is rely and know that it is Jesus Christ is the answer to all of your issues today. So as you are watching, if it is through live stream or if you are present today, receive, catch the fire that Jesus Christ wants to bring a solution to your problem in Jesus' name. Remember today that trusting in Christ Jesus is not a mere intellectual acknowledgement, but adherent to commitment to, trust in, faith in, and total dependence upon Him for everything. That is, you must depend upon Him to live, to move, and to have your being, because no state of being is as rewarding as living in tune with Jesus Christ. 
In other words, in coming to Jesus Christ for help and spiritual healing, we should have an eye to Him as the promised Messiah, the trustee of mercy and grace. Therefore, let the guilty, the empty, the naked, and the hungry be of good cheer and of comfort, for He calls them to be pardoned, filled, clothed, and supplied. You can see right now deliverance is taking place. The Holy Spirit all over her body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You demon, you unclean spirit. Fire all over your body. Fire all over your body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Speak clearly. Who are you? What have you done in her life? What have you done in her family? Yeah. Answer clearly right now yes, in the mighty sir. name of Jesus. Huh? Yes. Fire all over your body. What have you done yes, in her sir. career? Hey. What have you done in her career? In her family? <laughs> what troubles did you cause? Hey. Answer in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hey. In the mighty name of Jesus. Answer clearly. Hey. What have you done in her life? Hey. Who are you? <laughs> Fire the Holy Spirit. Fire the Holy Ghost all over her body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, I command you out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, I command you loose your grip. Because of Christ, Fire the Holy Ghost. You are in the arena of liberty. And you must leave this woman right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire all over. All over her body, from the top of her head to the bottom of her feet, I command you right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You lose this woman. Lose this woman. Lose this woman right now. Church, let's stretch our hands and let's begin to pray. Let's begin to ask for God's favor. Follow the Holy Spirit. All over her body right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Shoot demon, you unclean spirit. Leave her right now because of Christ. Lose your grip. Lose your grip. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you demonic spirit, you unclean spirit. Loose your grip right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose your grip. Fire all over your body. Fire all over your body right now. All over her body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You unclean spirit, you have no room in this place. You have no room in her body. Fire all over the body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You unclean spirit, listen to me right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Fire of the Spirit all over your body. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose her. Church, let's stretch our hands. Let's begin to pray. Loose her in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose her. Fire of the Holy Spirit. Fire the Holy Spirit. Fire the Holy Spirit. Fire the Holy Spirit. All over your body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. All over your body right now. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out. 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 Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus. Out because of Christ. Command you out in the mighty name of Jesus. Because of Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus. Because of Christ, out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, going to you out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out 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 of every fluid, out of every faculty of her body, out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Church, let's stretch our hands. Let's continue to pray. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 
fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You are in the arena of liberty. You have no other choice but to live in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire all over your body. Fire all over your body. Fire all over your body. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire all over your body. Holy Ghost, fire. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, you are free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Because of Christ, you are delivered in the mighty name of Jesus. Because of Christ, you are free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You unclean spirit, you demon, you are in the arena of liberty and you have no place but to leave her right now. Out! Out! Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 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 Out in the mighty name of Jesus. Out in Jesus' mighty name. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Fire all over her body, all over her feet, all over her body in the mighty name of Jesus. Fire, Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Church, let's continue to pray. Stretch your hands. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you must go in right now, right now, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You must go right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out out of every faculty of her body. Out of every fluid of her body right now. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. We declare you free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Church, let's put our hands together. Ma'am, how are you feeling? Say it again. You feeling great? Yes. Okay, okay. Why was this whole thing happening? Why were you spitting on us? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> it's the evil spirit that was in you that was performing those works. But now that the evil spirit has been gone, you are free and free forever. Say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm free. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm free. Right now we continue with the prayer line as people are still here waiting for their own touch from the Holy Spirit. And today is their day. We know that where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. And truly, this is the arena of liberty. This is the realm of freedom as, as the Holy Spirit is here with us creating an atmosphere of faith so today as we are here it is so important that we are all here in faith we must remain in such an attitude of faith knowing that it is faith that God responds to. When we come to Christ, we must come to Him with a genuine faith, a genuine cry from our heart, knowing that He is the one who brings the solution, who brings the change to our lives. We know that faith is the transformative power of the universe. It's the power of change. It is change from sickness to healing. It is the change from disease to good health. It is the change from bondage to freedom, from a faithless generation to a faithful generation. So it is so important today that we connect ourselves in faith. Wherever you are, reach out in faith because believing is your connection to Jesus Christ. So wherever you are, you can receive your own healing, your own deliverance, your own breakthrough as you connect in faith today because faith is the currency of heaven for which you can exchange your own problem for his solution in Jesus mighty name say I'm saved come on say I'm saved Jesus is my savior say I am healed Jesus is my healer say I am delivered because Jesus is my deliverer say pain and suffering Say troubles, troubles are things of the past. In the name of Jesus. Say, I am a new creation in Jesus Christ. Now walk in the light of your testimony.